Hey everybody, sorry we're a little bit late. We were getting it together just for you and we're psyched to be here. We're so excited for the show tonight and we can't wait for y'all to see it. And so we're very excited to start answering your questions right away. Yeah, so get them going, get them going. We have everybody here and uh, we're psyched that you were so patient. Thank you very, very much for uh, for coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go Tell the people you said hello. Hello from Sons of Serendip. The SOS. Uh, SOS. <laughs> you can see us. Yeah, yeah, let me move. Blue Journey. <laughs> the only one's not yeah. wearing blue here. <laughs> so, uh, let me, I'll kick it off uh, by answering a question. Uh, Timmy42 in Pennsylvania. Uh, Timmy was asking me uh, where Desmond is and also last night if Nick Kin kept the money. That is the question. So uh, first off, Desmond is still with me. Uh, I just don't call attention to him anymore, uh, but he still helps and he is uh, well fed and happy. Uh, and as far as the money goes, all I know is I walked off stage and I didn't see it again, but Nick did uh, walk in today with a brand new pair of shoes, so you do the math. I'm going to throw it the blue journey. Um, Thank you so much for taking the time to send us your questions, yeah. ask us your questions. Um, let's see here, what that first yeah. question is. I have so many to pick. Good okay. luck, guys. The question is, how high do you fly? Well, wow. Well, we, we, we jump as high as we can, and our choreographer, David, like can take things from a green screen and manipulate them to make us touch the ceiling or like not even get on the floor. So it's really like just editing and uh, the process of ed uh, creating the animation. In our piece for the quarterfinals, we were flying through the air, and it was like that time I went skydiving. You know, we were like 30,000 feet or so. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty yeah. awesome. Pretty awesome. All right, we're going to send it over to Sons of Serendip for answering questions. All right, thanks so much. This question comes from Dot in Massachusetts. She asks, do y'all ever rap? Uh, Dot, we haven't done so thus far. Especially, I have not. I don't know about the rest of the fellas. Except the Christmas with presents. Well, that's now that's, we come on. We almost had a rap going a second ago. We did, but you know, that that's on our later album. You know. <laughs> but do, do we rap? Micah, do you rap? Cadero? And we just rap presents, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, Dot, I hope you're happy with that. I'm going to pass this next question on over to Miguel Dakota. What's up, guys? Thank you uh, for the questions. I think we got one coming in now, right? I think so. Miguel, I'm typing it up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Are you feeling good about tonight, definitely Miguel? Definitely stoked for tonight. The uh, first question is... Is my celeb crush. Um, <laughs> I have to say, maybe I would go with Mel and Heidi. Those are two of my oh, celeb crushes. Good that answers. is very correct for the show. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't think he's. I am going to pass it to Emily. Why we are very excited to be here. We, I'm a, happy as a camper. I, I have a question, and uh, it is, uh, who inspires you when you feel like giving up? And that's from Jennifer. Um, I, Jennifer, you inspire me. Great. No, okay, my answer to that would probably be... Um, I listen to Barbara Streisand, and that girl gives me guts, and um, the show has really inspired me, but I also have a great family and a group of friends that I really rely on, so I look to Barbara Streisand and family and great friends, and Facebook and Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to hand it off to, uh, um, we're going to hand it off to Yo. these gentlemen. <laughs> David and Lehman. David and Lehman. Hello. Uh, how's it going? I'm David. I'm Lehman. And, uh, the question that we got was, if you make it to the top six, do you have any tricks that you have ever seen? This is from Dylan. Do you? Do I? 
Yeah. Well, I got so many tricks you haven't seen, Devin. I mean, I don't know how many tricks Devin has seen, so if this is a question specific, no, no. Basically, the question's over. Yeah, if you could send a list of tricks you've seen, <laughs> right? Uh, maybe you should know. Yes. Uh, sorry, Devin. There's a lot of facts that are. Going uh, on over to uh, Acro. Acro Army. Hi guys, how's it going? How long did it take for us to learn our feet? As far as how long it takes. To Three to four days. That's a lot of training. But um, that one, I don't have a name. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's going on, Christian, guys? get in here with Scooby. No. I guess with us and chatting with us, my question was, who gets more girls here at Scooby? The answer is definitely Scooby, no doubt. Mm. We walk, there it is. That's a perfect example. Uh, when we walk down the street, Scooby gets all the attention. So he's the, he's the recognized uh, part of the act. So the answer is definitely Scooby. Good question. And I'm going to pass it on now to Mr. Matt Franco. Hello, friends. Close to my people here. That means you guys and them. Let's see, we got a question from Josh. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Have you ever had a trick not work? Yes, I have had tricks not work before. It happens all the time. Magic is everything. I'm the only one who knows what's supposed to happen. But you gotta just roll with it, you know? It's not like uh, dancing. You know, if you're dancing, you fall down, everyone knows it's a screw up with magic. Mm -hmm. sure. Except one time when I was about 12, I was floating a giant ball. It fell and hit the ground and cracked in half. I think people knew that time, but, you know, I like to just roll with it and pretend it was all good. Thanks, Josh. Thanks for uh, bringing up those really memories. <laughs> <laughs> and I think I'm supposed to pass this off to someone. And I think we must back Hello, well, uh, I'd just like to apologize to Kevin. It was a great question. I, we shouldn't have dismissed it. So, uh, <laughs> and speaking of trying to uh, lead to people, uh, there is a Snapple Save tonight. If we are part of the Snapple <laughs> Save, we would like your vote, Devin, along with everybody's vote. Right. That goes wrong with us. Yeah, I mean, we all, they all want it. Yes. We all should. Yes. So, uh, oh, we should vote for us for the Snapple save because we love Snapple. I'm next on the list uh, for Snapple save. Okay, if I get on the Snapple save challenge, I want you to all go to your neighbor's house and get their phone and steal them. It's okay. <laughs> To steal everybody's uh, appliances that you have, or whatever. Oh, yeah. Even yeah. your blenders. Yeah. blenders. Vote on your blenders for me. Just remember to do that for me. Yeah. Miguel, what are you going to do? If, uh, I am in the Snapple save. Please, please uh, a vote for me. And a uh, vote for me is a uh, vote for freedom. <laughs> <laughs> right after Obama speaks. <laughs> All right. What are you going to do? Hey, what's going on, everybody? So, if you up in this Snapple save, please vote for us. We need your vote. And maybe I'll do this dance if you guys vote for me. Oh, shirtless, shirtless. But thank you guys for the support. I'm just going to give it to you. If I'm in the Snapple save and you vote me too, I'm going to be pumped out of my mind. It's going to be wild. I hope you guys do it. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. Uh, first, Acro Army, we'd like to thank you all for all of your guys' support. I mean, you guys is fantastic. awesome. And, like, just all you guys' best. Um, but you should be fun because in the next round, Maybe we'll knock you off your seats, yeah. But um, 
Is that a threat? Not a threat, just a promise. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, please vote for us. We really appreciate it. Bye. On to Quintavious. Woo! Take it away, Quint. Hey. Right. <laughs> so my question is, what is it like growing up in Nashville? <laughs> well, it's like I don't know. It's fun, I guess. Yeah, it is. Um, it's hot. It's hotter. Yeah, and it's like a lot of energy going. It's not as fast as New York, but it's very chill and nice and. It's a lot of music. It used to be just country, but now it's all over. Toss it to Mira. Uh, <laughs> um, my question is, who is your dream duet partner? And aside from Quintavious, um, <laughs> I would do, I don't know, there's so many, but I think I, it would possibly be Aretha Franklin the queen of soul, because that would just make my heart stop. <laughs> oh, my God, that would be amazing. Uh, yeah, that was a really good question. Thank you for that question. Uh, let's toss it to Amelia and Daryl. Yeah. <laughs> so, so our question is, besides the cello, what instruments do you play? And uh, we have a very good answer for that. We don't play anything else. <laughs> so it's just the cello. We concentrate all our efforts on that. Hope that answers your question. <laughs> What are we doing? So I guess like if I'm in the Snapple save, okay. Um, well, I guess I just gonna say vote for me a lot. You can do what Emily West said. Go to your neighbor's house, kill <laughs> every single client. Go to the dog phone or the bone or whatever. The dog phone. Whatever it has, you use that. Okay, love you. Bye. Um, if I am up for the Snapple save, I just want to say, obviously, please vote for me, <laughs> but um, that uh, this means everything to me, and I've loved my experience, no matter what happens, and that um, thank you guys for the love and support, and yeah, go to your neighbor's house, and <laughs> continuing to lie. <laughs> yeah, but thank you so much, and yeah, please vote for me. And if we're in the Snapple save, again, please vote for us. We love all of you. We need your votes. If we, if you don't vote for us, we won't make it through. So we need you. And we're going to add something else. Go to your local phone store. <laughs> so pretty much vote, 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 vote. vote. <laughs> all right. I'm going to pass it to Matt Franco. What's up, friends? It's been a great time hanging out with you. We really uh, appreciate you watching and coming to see us. And we're going to go backstage and relax a little bit before showtime. At show the time. ready. Oh. <laughs> Not the ready whip after and party yet. Uh, but you'll get to see some clips of that tonight. So please watch tonight. It'll be a few minutes late after the presidential address, but we need you to be there for us. Some of us undoubtedly will be in the Snapple save, so we need your help. Tune in, tell your friends, and see you tonight on NBC. Thank you so much. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.